how on earth does a genocidal, industrial-scale, human rights-abusing, free speech intolerant and planet vandalising regime square with those principles? It doesn't. In 2017, Xi Jinping claimed the International Olympic Movement, in its over 100 years, has played a positive role in enhancing all-round human development, deepening friendship between nations, and promoting peace, development, and progress. Everything that China has done since then and is still doing makes a mockery of that claim if the Beijing Olympics are allowed to go ahead in the form that the Chinese Communist Party wants, and its behaviour is allowed to be normalised, and they are allowed to score the major soft power propaganda victory they crave. That's why, Madam Deputy Speaker, that a motion passed by this House urging a diplomatic boycott is so important, mm. emphasising that, again, that we will not turn a blind eye to industrial-scale human rights abuses and hopefully impressing on the government the need to enact such a boycott so that no ministers, diplomats, royal family members and other VIPs dance to the tune of the Chinese Communist Party